example, and say, um, do you think I could have a wage rise? I know I only had one last month, but could I have another one this month? Well, your boss is going to say no, isn't he? Unless you've got a very good boss. But this is what it's like. It, it, it's actually like giving yourself a wage rise whenever you choose to do it. And, and, and what you're doing is creating uh, little income streams that whenever you need more money, you just create another one. And of course, that one adds and adds to your monthly income. And this is what happens. An affiliate started to promote and sell my ebooks. So I created more. Not being stupid, I started to create some more. Each one added to my income. And that's when the whole thing really did start to snowball for me. The income really started to come in when I had my own products out there and affiliates were, were uh, promoting them for me. Okay, so as I say, my life now is very, very different because of this. Just because of this and, and the other things that I do now, my life is very, very different. Part-time work. It says there I work two to three hours a day, actually. What I do is I, I, I may work a week at a time, and then I'll take some time off and go down the beach or go somewhere else, where, you know, wherever you feel like going. And, and then sometimes you'll work a couple of hours in the morning. Um, but I enjoy what I do, so it doesn't appear to be like work anymore. You know, and I'm not driven by the clock anymore. If I feel like staying in bed till 10 o'clock in the morning, uh, um, that's what I'll do. If I feel like uh, working sort of 6 o'clock till 8 o'clock at night, that's what I'll do. And, um, and the whole time that I'm out enjoying myself like this, Basically, I've got money coming in. And this is a dream life, okay? What I did, what I want to get across to you guys is that what I did is I actually packed in uh, a life of stress and, um, and what many to be, be, you consider to be the normal thing that we're all told to do. You know, the normal way of life, work nine to five, work hard till you retire and collect a pension, um, as, uh, you know, as many people will have said to you. I actually swapped all that for the life that I've got now. And let me tell you, it's, it's better. It, it, it is far, far better. Um, now, in a single day in this business, I've earned over £10,000, okay, from just one of my websites. Now, um, you know, people earn more than that, but £10,000 in a single day, that's not every day, but it can happen. And in fact, uh, my record now is £38,500 in a single day, okay? Now, again, there are people out there that earn an awful lot more than that. They probably work an awful lot harder than I do. Um, but 38,500 pounds in a single day, I didn't used to earn that in a year. And I've now made that in a single day. So this is the sort of thing that's possible. Okay? Um, and the thing is, this is easily copied. People make this complicated, okay? People... People make it complicated, and there's absolutely no need to make it complicated. I don't, I don't know whether um, you, you feel like it's sort of information overload and all the rest. Um, there's no need for it to be like that. All I do, I don't do complicated things, okay? All I do is I create simple little projects that actually go out and make me money on autopilot, and I keep creating them, and I keep creating them. When I finish one, I create another. And... And I don't do complicated things, okay? Because I've had enough complications in my life, if you like, and I don't like a complicated life. I like simple little projects that I can put out there that make me money on autopilot. So the thing is, someone famous once said this. It was me. Uh, okay, okay, semi-famous. There are no secrets out there, okay? There's just stuff that you don't yet know. There aren't any secrets. There's just stuff that you don't yet know, okay? But I can share with you, if you like, uh, my secret to success right from this stage. I'll share with you the three-step secret formula to inf information product success, and I'll share that with you right now. Would you like to see that? Yes. Yeah? Okay, this three-step product to success, and this is it, okay? Number one, find a hungry market with money to spend. Number two, find out what they want, and number three, sell it to them. Thanks very much. <laughs> All right, we'll talk a bit more about that. Um, but guys, that is it, okay? Really, seriously, that is it. You find a hungry market uh, with money to spend, you find out what they want, and you sell it to them. In fact, you don't even have to sell it to them, okay? You don't have to sell them anything. Because these guys, what we become as marketers is we become problem solvers, okay? 
We, we look for people. What I do is I basically look for people with problems, and I help them solve those problems, whatever those problems may be. Okay, so we become problem solvers. And when you're a problem solver and you're helping people uh, to solve their problems, you basically don't need to sell them anything. If it's right for them, they actually want it. They, they are hungry to take it off you. So this is, it's called poor marketing, okay? You don't actually have to sell them anything. They want what you've got already. Isn't that better than trying to force sell something to somebody? Yeah? Um, so, so basically, you don't have to sell them anything. So I did say that I was going to show you how you can have your own info product out there and selling by next weekend or even sooner. And what we're going to look at is we're going to look at the magic of private label rights products. Okay? Private label rights products. For those of you who don't know, what are private label rights products? Well, when you have private label rights products, in, in this example, we're going to use uh, an e-book as, as, as an example. And I'm going to show you, I'm going to walk you through a project, right? I'm just going to show you how easy this can be, and it doesn't have to be complicated. And this is just one of the ways that, uh, that I make money online, and, and there are an awful lot more, and I teach an awful lot more. But when you have private label rights to, uh, to a product, in this case an eBIC, this is what you get. You get the right to put your name on the product as the author. Okay? You get the right to, char uh, to change, I beg your pardon, or add to that product and call it your own. Okay, you, uh, oh, you need to check the license that you get uh, to, to, to make sure that you've got the full rights. But 99.9 .9 times out of 100, that's what you get when you buy the rights to sell an ebook. okay? The private label rights. You get the right to put your name on it as the author and call it your own, and the right to change or add to that product as you see fit. So what we said we needed to do was we, we said we needed to find a hungry market with money to spend, didn't we? So... That being the case, this is, how you, this is two simple, simple ways to find a hungry market with money to spend. And I teach a lot more than this, but there are two simple, easy ways. This is where you don't have to make it difficult for yourself. If you go to Amazon and check out the top 100 books in the non-fiction section, those are the subjects that are selling. Okay? They're the subjects that are selling. People are buying books about those products. Okay? So this is the market telling you what it wants. Clickbank, you, you, many of you all heard of Clickbank, of course, and if you go to Clickbank and check out uh, the marketplace section there, you'll th see things like business to business, um, uh, you'll see home and family, sports and recreation, all topics and niches. And if you do a sort by popularity, again, you'll have the top products in those categories shown to you and all laid out. Okay, so why make that? And that's just two simple ways. But why make life difficult for you, for yourself? Why not let the market tell you what it wants? And what you never do in this business is 